is a glorious event which occurs, whether we see it or not, every single day. And honestly, most of the time I'm in the dark of my room, missing out on the most sublime show. So this morning, before dawn, I hiked to the top of a hill to watch the miracle of a new day rising. As a redhead, I'm a bit fearful of the sun. I've had some horrible burns and rarely let the sun touch my unprotected skin. But a friend of mine introduced me to sun gazing, and I've been facing my fears by staring into the softer sun early in the morning and at sunset. Gazing into the brightest earthly expression of light, I've experienced healing and a deeper connection with the source of life. The sun is a reminder of the many ways that our human perspective veils the true nature of reality. For it's not the sun that's rising, but us who every day move towards then away from its omnipresence. Before gardening, I didn't really fully comprehend the miracle of the sun's light and its divine collaboration with nature. Plants can convert the sunlight, decayed material, CO2, and water into an infinite variety of colors and flavors, and of course, sugars, which make life possible for animals and us. But humans cannot survive on food alone. The rays of light from the sun reconnect us to spirit and the infinite love that permeates the universe. A force by its very nature we revere. I like how Shakespeare described this day. Even so, my son, when early morn did shine, with all triumphant splendor on my brow, but out alack he was but one hour mine, the region cloud hath masked him from me now, yet him for this my love no whit disdaineth, sons of the world may stain when heaven's sun staineth. Our whole lives, the miracle of our birth, the pain of our death, the joy of celebration, and the ache of grief, our every moment made possible, illuminated and shadowed by this fiery sphere 91 million miles away. We must cease believing that light is only vibrations rayed out by the sun, as modern physics and the ordinary human consciousness hold. We must become aware that soul is moving through cosmic space on the wings of light. Rudolf Steiner mighty light became obscured by a blanket of mist. We could no longer see the sun, but knew it was still there. And charged up with its rays, I took the warmth and light with me throughout the day. <laughs>